All right. Let's get this show on the road. Welcome back to more Bloodbath. Yahoo. Uh, all right. You beat Lanak? Hey, GG. Um, good job, Vegetable Soup. Um, that, when I was playing Crimson Clutter and you talked about it, you were like, you did not have much progress. I'm impressed you beat it so quickly. Um, let me just turn some of my lights on. And it's showtime. Um, I want to figure out a way to fix the, the delay problem, because on the completion, if the OD OBS audio is delayed, it might kind of screw things up a little. So, I mean, I, I want to find some way to sort of counteract that, find some sort of fix to the problem before I beat, um, Bloodbath. But for right now, I think it's probably fine. Anyway... Bloods bath. Tis the level. And actually, I am going to make a start pause. Uh, yeah, I, I do have smart start pause on, so... Well, the start position here. Um, I'll put one here, and I'll just have to remember to hold. Um. Took a bit of a break, came back, got some good runs on, and, and all your demotivation was gone, and you was were super motivated. Got dropped to 100 and eventually beat it. Yeah, good job. That Now that's how you beat a Geometry Dash level. <laughs> but, like, actually, you know Kai Guy's, like, Dash Academy thing? Turns out that was, like, kind of a scam anyway. Like, even if it wasn't, it sounds like a really stupid thing for, um... For, to like need someone to tell you how to play this game because it is like the most choose your own path game ever like I mean that's one of the main reasons I'm motivated to play it like because I get to choose all the hardest I do where I go it's just why the hell would I pay someone um why the hell would I pay someone just um for them to tell me how I'm supposed to improve like that's just stupid I don't know why anyone would ever do that. Like, I, I I have no harsh feelings towards the people who were sponsored by it, but Kai Guy? Man, he just sucks. He's like a terrible guy. Considering his YouTube shorts. Putting that into the equation as well. Like, I mean, he's just... On my GD YouTubers tier list, he's not very high at all. Um, for gravity.
you don't need Dash Academy or Geometry Smash to be good at GD mentally. Exactly. Like, why would anyone need that to get better at the game? Hello, Maria and Golia Buio. Please forgive me if I pronounced that wrong. Uh, welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good day. Uh, I should probably sort of position this like this. And that'll probably work better. Making progress, making progress on nine circles. You got 41, GG, you're gonna beat it soon. Uh, you saw a guy, a video of a guy promoting it and basically everyone in the comments said, yeah, you're definitely paid, we get it. Yeah, like, I mean, I hate sponsorships. Like, I, no, I don't hate them. I think it's, I think it's fine for creators who are hardworking to get um, paid through other means if necessary you know that's totally reasonable i have no issues with that um it's just i you can never trust sponsorships you can't like i mean someone who's paid to say the game is good will have no integrity saying the game is good because let's face it they're not talking the money is like there's me there's no way to tell if there's any um, actual decency put into the good review on the game. And essentially, there pretty much isn't if they're paid to say it. So, like, sponsorships for me are just pointless, and you'll never get me to buy something because of one unless I've already wanted to buy the product anyway. So... <laughs> I mean, that's kind of, like, obvious. Like, I don't know who else wouldn't... I don't know who would would actually, like, try to... Who would actually be convinced by a sponsorship? Why am I putting a checkpoint there? I don't know who would be convinced by a sponsorship, but, like, you know... Just don't... Don't... <laughs> don't get something because of a sponsorship. Never. N don't do it because of an ad, either. Yeah, stuff like BetterHelp, Raid Shadow Legends, Honey. Honey is really bad because it literally just, it, it, it advertises how it doesn't do anything. It just saves you money. It sells your data to, like, companies like Facebook without you knowing. It uh, It's kind of like a Facebook problem where, it, like, it does really, really bad things with your data. Um, Raid Shadow Legends is just a really terrible game. It's, like, it has gambling, it's pay to win, it's just garbage. Um, and BetterHelp is literally abusive. <laughs> like, I've only heard nightmare stories about BetterHelp. No one has ever, like, I've never heard about someone who's had a bad time with, a, 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 had a good time with BetterHelp. Um, and also it's insanely overpriced. You're trying to do Water Temple and an Insane Demon and Nine Circles after you beat water temple you'll go for forest temple yeah the the temple levels are good i want to do those at some point in like a big series video but that would be a little bit tedious so i will do that another time yeah i don't think i need to put any checkpoints in between those parts well someone told me to get a click pattern for this so i mean sure why not <laughs> And I need to put one here, because this ship part's actually hard. And then I might want 
Mark practice these clips. Oh my god, okay. It's funny when it does that. Um, put one there. And put one there. Alright, yeah, I think we're good. Why is it mini? Why is it mini? There we go. Nope, never mind. What if I hit mini mode? Um, better help is definitely stuck in some controversies. Yeah, I don't know how people are still getting sponsored by it. Like nothing has happened. It'll take a lot of time to beat nine circles. You have six thousand plus attempts on nine circles, and you just got forty-one. Yeah, just just keep going. Find strategies. Get good routines, and you'll be good. But, like, maybe if I, yeah, if I put on mini mode, it doesn't work. Nope. Yeah, G Boy's part is just not working. Okay, hold on. <laughs> what about there? Why is it mini? <laughs> come back bye all right see you maria have a good day what if i put it up here no so many Oh, wait, why didn't I just put a portal here? Just do that. <laughs> Boom. Problem solved. Why did I have to go through all that, all that trouble? Even though it's basically nothing at all, you did G-Boy to 100 on Bloodbath, not going to, to, for Bloodbath yet, and you're doing a different extreme. Ah, G-Boy's actually pretty hard. I mean, my hardest was different descent, and I tried to... I, I tried to do that run. It took me, like, 6,000 attempts for just that run. Um, but it was on a separate copy, and I lost the attempt, so, I mean... You know, beats me, like, exactly what happened after that. But, like, you know, that, that thing's hard. G-Boy's hard. <laughs> and it's harder than a lot of people say. Alright, now everything should work. Yeah.
and I landed on the corner. 60 death, no clipper on. Ah, cool. Yeah, that's not as good. I would say that's not as good as G-Boy to 100, but yeah. No clip runs generally can't really be used as a deciding factor of progress. I usually just do them for fun. Stop. There we go. I'm going to test all these start positions. Yeah, that works, I think. Yep. Lobotomy, fire in the hole. Also, hello, Frisk Man. It was mainly for fun. Uh, yeah, I get that. I, I sometimes just do runs on hard, really hard levels or levels that are already beaten for no reason just because it's fun. <laughs> Welcome back, Maria. Hope you're doing well. Oh my god. Like, those first few clicks in the straight fly. Like, if I can pass those, I'll beat it. Like that. That UFO click is evil. Fingers locking a lot though, I might have to warm up. Give me one sec, I'm dehydrated, I'm gonna go get water.
Bloodbath is possible on mobile. It doesn't have any really, like, really close to frame perfect inputs, so that's kind of to be expected, but yeah. Try to get Mishy from zero. Yeah, that's one of my goals. I practiced Mishy a lot yesterday off stream. So hopefully I should be able to get somewhere far into it or pass it when I get there for zero. Oh, I did take that down. Alright, good. You are going to be at a new hardest platformer soon. After I beat Bloodbath and a few other extremes, I'm probably going to go for the tower. The tower 22. Because that level looks kind of cool. And there is going to be a platformer level in the hard, in the hard DMM um, alphabet. I know it's not speed tech. In this game, everything is possible. Pretty much. I mean, if I spent all my time in the future trying to beat, I don't know, Tidal Wave, after like three years, I probably could. <laughs> kind of like what Herx is doing. He's doing an absolutely massive jump of toe to the tidal wave. Which part of me believes he'll complete, part of me doesn't. Yeah, it is already done. You after five years, you will Tartarus on mobile. Mobile? Do you mean you'll beat Tartarus? Because I mean, I don't know if it's possible on mobile, <laughs> considering the hardest mobile completion currently ever. I'm pretty sure he's like either Cold Sweat, Yadagarasu, or Oblivion, and Oblivion's below Tartarus on the demon list right now. So. Good luck with that. Tartarus, I'm pretty sure, does have some near frame perfect inputs. After all, it's like a top 40. <laughs> But like I mean, if it's it's if it's really possible in your in your game, then I'm game. I mean, go you, <laughs> go for it.
you don't know if it's even possible, but you'll still try, then go for it. <laughs> I have doubled the start pauses you have on following up. Yeah, I place too many. That's kind of just a thing I do. <laughs> or no, I I, I want to get um 42 to 100 today, so I'll play from crack for, for I'll play from crack for a little bit. And I have been playing this a lot off stream. So, I mean, it's just I haven't had time to start to stream <laughs> recently. Because I've been working on stuff like the Rewind or whatever. Keep in mind, I am getting close to done with the Rewind. I've completely finished all of the um, pre-break streams for the True Threat Rewind um, for Cool Bonnie. Um, I finished all of those, so it's just the post-break ones, which are gonna be a bit more quantity over quality, so they won't, won't be as hard to edit, hopefully. <laughs> Water Temple is bad. Um, it's very annoying, you know? Oh. Yeah, I mean, the Michigan levels, I mean, RIP and all, but, like, Michigan's gameplay, I mean, it's not... It's, it's not great. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm not gonna go any further because I don't want to be disrespectful, but Michigan's gameplay isn't always perfect like people make it out to be. Oh, I forgot to mention. I, I named the club step monsters in this part. Alright, ready? So this guy, he's a meanie. This guy right here, he sucks. He's really mean. His name's Florence. Alright? So if we can just get past him real quick. This is Angus. He's nicer. I like him. Angus is cool. Can everyone say hello, Angus? Can everyone in chat say ha hello, Angus? Hello, Angus. How are you doing?
Don't say hello, Florence. Florence sucks. I hate him. <laughs> hello, Angus. Screw hello, Fitzgerald. Hello, Angus. <laughs> How many attempts am I at right now? I've lost a lot of progress, so I'll have to count, like, individually every single- all the time count in every single stream and recording. But according to the game... 289 there. 13,864 there. Oh, I forgot to, like, hold on. 10 stars... Oh, verify hack, hold on. Yeah. All right, there we go. <clears throat> what? Why isn't the start pause here? falling down <laughs> you're at exactly 5,000 right now oh cool on mobile the wave is the worst on nine circles I mean the wave in nine circles for me wasn't that bad honestly I'll use it to warm up why not because hold on I think uh, on um, PC the wave is actually probably the easiest part the pre-drop is really hard though <laughs> Like, I don't think I remember the click pattern for the ship. Yeah, like what? <laughs> Oh, 
but because I like the Hertz differences and the FPS differences and the um, physics differences, you know, I might have a completely different experience with this level than you had, than you have. Then I I can't speak. Okay, you get the idea, though, right? <laughs> In the whole game, the wave and the ship are hard, yeah. Play the wave. Dong dong Damn. <laughs> Close. There we go. This ain't bloodlust? Of course not, dude. <laughs> um, Summer is around the corner and you will get a PC and play GD on PC, but you'll still play on mobile because you want to become the best mobile player in GD. Yeah, that's cool. That's totally fine. I, I'm pretty sure most mobile players just choose to be the mobile player. Be a mobile player. They don't do it because they have to. Oh, swing is hard because no one uses it. Fair, yeah. Like s swing copter, yeah. It's a new game mode, but like, I ha I really haven't seen that many like genuinely hard two point two levels that use it. So like, I I haven't gotten really practiced with it. I I got really comfortable with like old swing copter with like dual blue arms when I played diffuse, but like. You know, I kind of lost consistency with that when I had to get used to new swing copter, and I'm still not fully used to new swing copter. It's fine, because it's not used that much, but still. <laughs> uh, I think I'm warmed up now. There was a guy in my chat who was disgusted by the fact that I didn't have a click pattern. So, I mean, I guess I gotta develop a click pattern for this now. I mean, everyone said the spider was so hard, but 2.1 came out. We're going to get used to it in maybe a year or something. Yeah, that's fair. That sounds about right.
Oh, I, f I forgot to check if evasion works. Yep, it does. My hypothesis was correct that if I placed the start position in that specific spot, it would work. Still really bad at evasion, though, for some reason. You want to be the first mobile player to beat the demon mobile list, but that will take 20 years. You have a lot of time. You're 11 years old. Okay, don't, first of all, don't share your age on the internet. That's a very bad idea. <laughs> Second of all, um, I don't know if Geometry Ash is really going to be popular and the mobile list is going to exist for that long, but I mean... And also, you know, like, college and stuff exists that might get in your way. So, I mean, just, I don't know if 20 years is, like, you know, the normal amount of time. Hello, Spooderman. Welcome. No, nobody knows where knows where you live. I mean, yeah, but like, still, don't share your age on the internet. That can, you know, that can just that can I don't know. That can bring some bad news. Or like people who think with things I can't really like talk about on the stream. Like, just be safe on the internet. All right, that's just my advice. Don't share things that are personal. Unless you have, like, other precautions you take that are, that, um, make sharing some stuff alright. Oh my god, the pink orbs? Those are easy. Come on, guy. Yeah, I don't know where the, the country you live, but, like, people can still, like, yeah, Guitar Hero styles. Just need I say more. People do, if you reveal your age, people can do pretty creepy, weird things to you. Based on that, it gives you much more vulnerability on the internet. It doesn't mean you're necessarily unsafe in person, but it can bring bad news online. And trust me, you don't want that. You really don't. <laughs> You're going for I Spy with My Little Eye instead of Problematic because you're getting more progress on it? Yeah, that's easier. I, I would recommend that, but you should probably return to Problematic after afterwards. That's my suggestion. Bald Man was the man who made you play GD again in 2021 at EVW. Yeah. I get that. He wasn't really my motivation to really play. 
I don't think any YouTuber was, GD YouTuber was, besides, like, I don't know, Aeon. But Aeon, like, I mean, Aeon only kind of inspired me. <laughs> I can just kind of played for my own motivation. I don't know what that meant. Played for my own motivation? I don't know what I'm saying at this point. <clears throat> Excuse me. You quit before then because you had a skill issue. <laughs> L. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I'm so sorry. That was the meanest thing ever. I'm so sorry. I really need to get better at evasion. But I've actually gained a lot of consistency with Michigan, I think. I think I'm going to place that star position up higher. Oh, wait, no, I can't because I already uploaded it. Damn it. Here, I have an idea. I think I can just fix it. Hold on. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Remove that from the servers. Um, what if I just do this? Yeah, that's still low down. There we go. I fixed it. Hooray. All right. Um, bro inspired himself. You are inspired by this guy named Vegetable Soup to start beating demons? Man. That sounds like a really cool guy. I never met him. Nobody will call you because how Discord works. You don't have Instagram, Ray, Facebook, Twitter. You don't have anything but YouTube. People can still comment weird stuff, though. So just keep that in mind.
And yeah, YouTube may be able to take it down, but they won't take it down instantly. And you'll still see that stuff, and it'll still, like, screw you up. Like, I've been, as someone who has been, like, um, not in that sort of way, but, like, I've seen, at one point I saw a video, I'm not gonna go into depth about what it was, but someone showed me a video that was extremely traumatic, <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah, just be careful on the internet, alright? People, people do weird things, and not everyone on the internet is hunky-dory. Just, yeah, be careful out there. Anyway. What? Excuse me? What? What? Oh, there we go. Someone showed you a YouTube video that traumatized you when you were young, too? Yeah, it, it wasn't a YouTube video. It was... It was a video that was too inappropriate to be on YouTube. It was not in, like, a sexual way. It was... It was a very actual real life gory video that was extremely disturbing. And honestly, I still think about it. It happened back when I was playing Arnimicia, I think. So it's not something that like ruined my, you know, but like, I think <laughs> just be careful. Don't end up in that situation because it's really awful to be, have to be forced to think about something that someone put on your shoulders. It was a gory cartoon. Oh, <laughs> that's much what. And that's, I mean, I I have seen much. Yeah, ne never mind. All I'm saying is just be careful on the internet, end of. Because sometimes you might see something that you want to unsee. And you can't. Anyway. Uh, <clears throat> you have 25 minutes left and then you go to sleep. Alright. Well... Whenever you go, I, uh, that's totally fine. I mean, I'm not, like, trying to keep anyone here. Just go when you need to go. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh. Oh, so it was, like, an offensively gory cartoon. Oh, then that's reasonable, yeah. And it's been removed from YouTube. Yeah, okay. The level looks rate worthy. I'm not sure if it's rate worthy or not. Um, but like, it's certainly cool. Something doesn't have to be rate worthy to be cool. I think Simsar is a cool level. And the rate worth the rate standards are like absurdly high these days. <laughs> And that's why it makes me mad that Rob Top took so long to rate Tidal Wave, yet he also he instantly rated this and featured it 
Or wait, no, this isn't. This isn't the same map. Where is it? Is this it? No, this isn't it. Where is it? Yes, this is it. Why did he rate this? This is not rate worthy. When was Rob on? And also those designs look very something. You never know, yeah, that's fair. But like, why did he rate this? This is like a recent tab level. And also the gameplay is like really bad. There's some really bad looking levels that got rated recently. Tell me about it. This is just one of them. Like the rate system is just on crack or something. Like this is terrible. And I'm still family friendly technically because it's just cracks part, you know? Cracks part on Bloodbath. Get it? So I'm fine. <laughs> but yeah. Levels, am I right? And I don't even get what to do here. What what do you do? What do you do? Apparently those things have spikes in them. What? But this is garbage. <laughs> this is not a rate worthy level. And also this should probably be demon. He rated you've been trolled, but that was a while ago. That was back in like early 2.0, and by then it was like a new creative idea. I don't hate that one as much. Your mom said to go to sleep. Bye. All right, see you, Maria. Um, have a good break and have a great rest of your day or night. Um, seen some basic looking nine 1.9 levels rated, but yeah, that's that's like. One point. I think mean like Whoa Sonic being rated right now. I think that's rate worthy. I think it was a cool idea, pulled off really well in like two point one standards. Um, I think Whoa Sonic's actually really cool. Um, one point nine. Looking. If you mean like back in one point nine, then I disagree because I think you know one point nine rate standards. You know, it was still in the stage where you could just make something for fun and it'd get rated. Now, you have to put, put put your life and soul and blood and tears into making a level just to get a star rate. So, I mean, <laughs> you know, getting a rate-worthy level is like a, for creators is around as hard as, like, I don't know, beating a difficult extreme demon. <laughs> I don't know from experience, so I'm just guessing. Someone correct me if I'm wrong, but, like, Getting a rate worthy level is really hard. And this level is terrible. And it's such a disgrace because there are so many cool levels out there that just don't get rated. Well, this, this easily, Rob's just like, all right, cool. Boom, rated. Like, what? You're gonna play some Rocket League while watching me. All right, see you, Frisk Man. See you, Spooder Man. Have a great day. Oh, uh, but yeah. Pff. That level's something.
you're not going, you're just watching watching me on your phone and playing in your room. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Man. <laughs> Why is it not working? Um. Well, uh, well, so I think it'll be anyway, baby. <sighs> Sorry about that. I was yawning. Um. I think there are a few. Um. I, of course, there's Mamory Month. I want to do um, Hopping Over Puddles at some point. I want to do Carcano someday. That level looks cool. Um, um, and there are a couple like in cool and St. Demons I want to do, like Acropolis and Necropolis. Maybe Ultrasonic, too. You can look on my Discord server. Uh, my level status page is completely de dedicated to that. That transition isn't that hard. Okay. 
Screw it. Let's go from zero. Good run. Yeah, I I've gotten pretty consistent with Michigan for how hard the part is. Almost made it into that portal. Damn it. got 15 twice in a row yeah it's it's cool but like my my best is 19 so it's not that big of a deal if i can just get to the ball <laughs>
I love YouTube emojis. Come on, stop. Please pass that. Can I just get to the ball like once? Oh my god. <laughs> Please. I beg. Stop. It's not that hard. Okay, come on. Please, guy. Thank you, guy. Hey, Cubic, welcome.
Stop, please, dude. You're cl so close to being congregation. Okay, so you're like really good at the game. All right, <laughs> but go. <laughs> Hopefully you can beat it soon. Good luck, dude. My heart. My heart is cold. My heart is cold! You got scared when you heard congregation? Well, I mean... How about... How about... How about this? <laughs> and this. <laughs> that one's actually good. Alright, yeah, goals for today, I'm hoping I can get close to 42 to 100, so at least 42 to 90, and I want to get to Michigan from zero. I'm going to try to get Michigan from zero first.
God damn it. Oh, come on, please. Never give up.
come on. You gotta go now, bye. Alright, see you, it's Spooderman. Have a great rest of your day. God damn it. Please, dude. Please. Oh my god. My finger is locking like I can't straight fly. Stop. I'm so bad at the beginning. garbage.
Be right back. Alright, see you until then. Vegetables. See you then, vegetable soup. <clears throat> I am very bored. Stop. 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 What the hell? I can't even get through the cave. I'm playing so bad. Oh my god, dude. What am I doing? Ugh. Yeah, it could like, I don't know, get somewhere. Yes, dude, let's go. Yes! Thank you. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. That's kind of like all I really wanted to do today. I guess I'll have one more attempt to the ball from zero. But after that, I think I will do some runs. Because I need to get 42 to 100. That is a run on my agenda.
Welcome back, vegetable soup. I got to Michigan. I just want to get to the ball one more time, and then I'll do some runs. Hello, Jagar. Welcome. How are you doing? Um, want to know a good person? Sure. This is not a level request stream. You, so play your level. What? <laughs> so you're saying that since you're a good person, which I have no evidence for you being a good person, since that, because of that, you want me to play your level when this isn't a level request stream. I mean, I'm kind of bored, so you know what? Fine. <laughs> but, I mean, there no more after this. This is your only one. 101. 226992. Okay, this is a level. Is this meant to be like a extreme demon or something? I'll have the same percent as you on bloodbath. Oh, so you have a higher percent than me? Oh. You've made it to Michigan? Oh. I had no idea. This all seems kind of cool. Dude, I'm reading chat. Chill out. My hardest is extra wide. And I've also beaten Crimson Clutter and Crazy 3. And I've barely practiced this. Like, I mean... I'm sorry, but that is not a medium demon level jump. And I can't see anything here. Oh, so you go under that one. And where is the song? I have my desktop audio turned down. Yeah, people have different skill sets, dude. You said you're a good person.
God damn it. I said no more level requests. Um, hello the mountain. Welcome. How are you doing? But yeah, no, I said no more level requests. So sorry, I'm not playing that. It's just this level seems kind of interesting. So I'm going to see if I can beat it. When you see me constantly failing at that first jump, it's because I'm looking at chat. Alright, stop. Dino the triple. There we go. Yeah, I said no more level requests. Hello, Rick Kimble 063 or RKM BM 063. Welcome. Yeah, this level's pretty unbalanced. Like, the first few timings are, like, genuinely difficult. <laughs> but, like, I mean, these this robot's. Why did I die there? Um, these first few timings are pretty easy. Pretty easy. What am I saying? I My brain is farting. But yeah, this ship is free. Like, this ship is so much easier than the first few timings. Oh my god, why did I die there? What am I doing? Boom. But yeah, these first few timings are actually hard. Why did I say they're easy? What am I on? And for some reason, I'm dying to that now. So, whatever. <laughs> What am I doing? Boom. 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 Simple. Boom. Done. There we go. Alright. What am I doing? That, top, that gap is so free, dude. Oh my god. What's the hardest part in Bloodbath, Michigan? This is not Bloodbath, by the way. Some random guy who's kind of mean um, gave me a level request, and I guess I'm playing this now. 
And apparently he says it's a medium demon. I don't think this is a medium demon. This does not look like a medium demon to me. And that, that's just a random 2.0 moving object. So that's great. No way to sight read that. Yeah, they can be. Oh my god, what am I doing? Pass the wave. That literally chopped down before I could exit. <laughs> Moving objects, am I right? Stop. It's insane that I beat it. Thanks. I, I appreciate that. Yeah, Crimson Clutter. The thing about Crimson Clutter is it's just really, really tight. <laughs> like, there's no learniness to it besides, like, one part. It's just tight. Oh my god, what am I doing? 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 Am I a dunce? Maybe. Boom. Boom. 
Boom, not that hard. Boom, boom. Thank you, that's all I wanted. But, yeah, no. 10,000 attempts! And he was all like, wow, you can't do this first attempt in one jump. Uh, you can't do this first jump in one attempt? And he spent 10,000 attempts to verify this. I have gotten 63, and I have spent less than a 50th than he has so I don't know what he's doing this bloodbath is actually visible yeah like you can actually sight read bloodbath And I hate it when people just come come here, like, not to actually, like, say anything or do anything related to the stream. They just ask for a level request. Or just tell me to do a re level request or demand it. Level requests now when it's not a level request stream. Like, they don't actually care about the stream. They just want someone to play their level. And the times where I have done this, I just play it. They say, cool, and they leave. They don't actually stick around. And I hate it when people do that. People are greedy, yeah. And that guy was just mean. He literally said, you know who's a good person? Me! So do my level request. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> I hate level requests. Yeah, like, dude. If you want someone to do your level request, go to a level request stream. Like, I know a guy, Kuzu2000. He does level requests. Go to him. And he was, like, insulting me and, like, saying I'm not ready to play Bloodbath because I, I couldn't instantly do the first jump when he spent 10,000 attempts on that level. And I spent 200, and I got, I got 60%. He is not a good person. I do not think so either. And then after I literally said, this is your only level request, he asked for another one. My god, these people, they just want someone to play their levels. They don't actually give a crap about the quality of the stream. They don't actually want to tune in. Imagine your only purpose in life is just to advertise your level on a stream about beating a demon. Some people just have no life. Yeah, like, I mean, I don't know about... I think having no life is a little far, but, like, I mean... Come on, <laughs> just tune in a, in a stream for the stream, not for your level. Literal robots, I know, right? Also, welcome back, Cubic. Non-human.
That guy should try bloodbath since he thinks he's so good. Yeah. For real. Can he get cracked to 89? Can he do the entirety of Michigan? I bet he can't. Like, I'm not trying to be, like, super mean or anything, but dude... It's actually that that ballpark after the string fly isn't actually that bad. Like I mean, I, I'm just playing really bad today. <laughs> I just not playing super well from zero. Yeah, in ten thousand attempts, and he's all like, "You can't do the first cute first try. You're so bad." And it's like, bro, your harness is deadlocked. And I've literally beaten Crazy t crazy 3, Crimson Clutter, Extra Wide, over 20 hard demons, 10 insane demons, and in total over 100 demons. You've beaten 2. And you're like, like, dude... Put in the actual work before saying you're better. Yesterday was your one year your one year anniversary anniversary of beating Bloodbath. Hey, GG. I'm better than that kid will ever be. I don't know if then he will ever be. Because, you know, he can improve and someday I might fade away from the game. But, like, yeah. <laughs> and I'm not, like, bullying him for being not as good as me. I'm just saying, don't, like... Don't, like, try to pretend there's, you're better than someone when you haven't done jack shit. Thanks. <laughs> I feel like the people who are better at the game are actually a lot of time nicer than the people with easy demon harness. Yeah, like those people... A lot of people with like those easy demon harness, the people who are like, I don't know. How do I put this? Like not familiar with the game. They don't have like a grasp on difficulty and like how much commitment you need. So like a lot of those people... A lot of them can be nice. Like, the majority of my chatters haven't beaten anything harder than a medium demon. But. You know. That makes sense. Because a lot of people with easy demon hardists don't have a full grasp on difficulty and, like, commitment. So they don't understand when someone has put a lot of effort in into something and they don't understand how how hurtful it is to minimize that and i hate it when people do that but seasoned people can be more understand understand understanding and empathetic look i don't hate the kid but like Come on, just be nicer to people. People who beat hard levels actually can respect people because they know what it is like to suffer through an extremely hard demon. Yeah, exactly.
yeah, I, I, yeah, vegetable soup. That's exactly right. Like, as I said, I really don't hate that kid. It's just I wish he was a little nicer. <laughs> Yes, you usually had to. Yeah, that's, I think, RKBM, I think that's a little rarer, but, like, yeah, that's fair. I have heard of, I have heard horror stories about people who are actually like that. Uh, first time you had to struggle through a demon was your first hard demon. Doesn't sound that bad until you realize you did like a six tier jump and your hardest was one of the easiest medium demons. Oh Damn, okay Yeah, my biggest jump in this game. I'm not sure. Um My progression my heart my progression in terms of hardest hold on let me pull it up um Yeah, um, my first demon was Club Sep, then I did Deadlocked, then was, then it was Verity, that was my first medium demon, then I did Chaos Airflow, which is one of my least favorite levels in the game, um, then Ultraviolence, which is actually one of my favorite levels in the game, um, and then Different Descent by Don Dank or Donke, however you pronounce it, which was my first hard demon. Then Scarlet Pulse by Gecko, which is also a hard demon, but it is number one on the HDL, so it's basically an insane demon. So it was kind of it was kind of a jump. I would say that might be one of my bigger jumps. Um, then was Edo, which was my first insane demon, and then was Extra Wide, which was my which is my current hardest. And so I think different ascent to Scarlet Pulse and Edo to X Ride are my two biggest jumps. And they're still not very big. So I haven't really jumped that much. But I do have some big jumps planned in the future. So stay tuned for that. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I've been an Edo.
And honestly, Ado was kind of a stepping stone to prepare me for this because of its tight ship. So you're probably gonna avoid jumping again. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I haven't. I've yet to really experience a big jump. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I've. In terms of all my insane demons, I've beaten. I've beaten Extra Wide, Crimson Clutter, Crazy 3, Edo, Backrooms, Terminate Mold, Crazy 2, Poltergeist, Windy Landscape, and Chromicide. So, those are all my insane demons right now. Yeah, I need to do runs, so I'm just gonna get one more run to the mini ball, and then I'll ch do some runs. That is a lot. I think. I mean, you should check out Seb. He's my friend. He's beaten over 100 Insane Demons. He's, he's crazy with Insane Demons. He's like a big fan. Especially Memory Insane Demons. That's like his favorite thing. Memory, IDL, Insane Demons. He loves those. I'm gonna do some runs. I'm gonna try to get this to a hundred. Acropolis is, oh, sorry, the, you think the only thing more satisfying than that was when you beat Acropolis, did it how it wasn't really a great level and you took a while on it, ah, yeah, that's fair, my buddy Frisman, he beat Acropolis, and most of my friends have beaten Acropolis, I haven't yet, I do want to at some point, um, but yeah, that level doesn't look like the greatest thing of all time, <laughs> No, I almost got past that sir. Damn.
Yeah, that was close. I hit the ore by accident. If I had probably if I had let go there, I probably would have been fine. Damn. Ah, damn it. If I practice from evasion, then it'll help getting consistent on that and transitioning into the ship. The transition isn't actually that hard for me. Yeah, I'm kind of bad at evasion. But right now, I'm really trying to focus on just getting this run because I know I can do it. I thank you for the suggestion, though. I probably will do that later. It's just right now, I'm working on Crack to 100 because I feel confident with that and I think I can do the run soon. Thanks for understanding that. Thanks for understanding that. My voice died at that. By the way, uh, RKBM, what's your hardest? Just curious. Bath. Oh, cool. Is that your only extreme demon, or have you beaten others?
Oh my god. No! No, dude! So close! That was so close! No, and I passed everything in G-Boy! No! That was so close! Forty two to ninety six. No, no, <sighs> yeah, good run. I just barely clipped this hall blade. My dedication is amazing. I don't know if my dedication is amazing, but thanks. <laughs> I don't think I'll beat this like soon, soon, but I think I will beat it before the month ends. That's my guess. Also, my friend Friskman, I'm kind of racing him with this. He's doing falling up as his first extreme. You should go support him as well. If you want. Because. He is working equally as hard as I am. And he's really cool. He has a great channel. So. Yeah. I don't think he's streaming right now. But he does stream sometimes. So. Yeah. Yeah.
down. That's a dumb duck. You'll check them out. All right, cool. Thanks. Cool, thanks. Oh my god, that was a voice crack. Jesus. <laughs> Yeah, that's right.
You don't really have any tips for this level except that practicing the last 30% helps with getting consistent at the end. Ah, okay. Yeah. I, I've practiced that a fair bit considering I have 70 to 100. But, yeah, I, I get that. For some reason, you find bloodbaths really fun. I get that. A lot of people find bloodbaths really fun. Like Sicky, for example. I think it's Sicky's favorite level in the game. <laughs> or at least one of his favorites. We only have 26, but that 26 is pretty fun. Ah. Yeah. Hold on, I'm gonna say something. Give me one sec. Yeah, um. I, I didn't know you were so far into Bloodbath. Like, your hardest is Layak. <laughs> That's more progress on Bloodbath than I have. Because for some reason I'm sucking at the beginning today. Like, I'm really good at everything else today. It's just the beginning is, like, kicking my ass. You might have had some fun with it. Um. If you didn't die to the end, like, 20 times. Ah, uh, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> yeah, that can ruin your, re your reputation with the level. You also know some of the parts pretty well, you just suck at pulling them off. Ah, okay. Yeah, that's 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 how I was when I was like beating hard demons and stuff. Or sorry, insane demons. water Out of practice time, you'll be able to get through it much easier. Vegetable soup, yeah, that's 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 true. That goes for pretty much any level.
put in some real practice, you could definitely pull it off. You just don't want to practice a level you're not even going for yet too much. Ah, yeah, that's fair. Bloodbath will be your second or third extreme that you go for as the hardest. Haven't quite decided yet. Ah, okay. So you are planning on doing it in the future. <sighs> I'm probably going to go pretty soon. I just want to hold out the last few attempts left and see if I can get this to 100. Might be an extreme thing, though. Don't want to reveal it yet, but you want to say you're not 100% sure. You have a level in mind, but you have to practice it to see if it's fun. For the possible next hardest and first extreme. Ah, okay. Yeah, good luck if you do end up going for it. I think I'm gonna get one more run to answer from here and I'm gonna call it quits.
dude. Oh my god. Why? Why? Thank you. Alright. I'm gonna be done. That was a very good session. I almost got 42 to 100, and I got to Michigan from zero. I think I pretty much accomplished my goals. So, yeah, I did what I wanted, and I think I'm happy. So, I... Yeah, I think I'm just gonna head out now. Um, yeah. I will... I will see you guys possibly tomorrow, whenever I stream next. I might upload some of the progress um, in the stream as a video, I'm not sure yet. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.